Hi guys, I'm Shmi. Hello to you. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to the Gumball Garage in London. It's the night before the official arrivals, but loads of the cars are here getting their stickers in the garage. And we're going to be doing the final parts of the wrap on my air ETR. The Benzene Ben is very noisily driving, but we're calling this the Country Camera. <laughs> That's Mr. Car 2's 812 Superfast. The country camo, we need to finish it off on the car before we get our stickers. But we are surrounded by a Ventador S, RS6, RS6. You can see the Ferraris, you can see the lines of cars that are in this garage. We're gonna take a look at what's going on this evening, get the wrap finished up with the Dub Customs boys, and then it'll be time for stickers afterwards. Good times here in London. Now, for the minute, we're going to take a double parking space just to have more access to get around the car to do the rest of the vinyls. So, of course, Dub did the Solar Dub yellow, like AMG Solar Beam wrap on the car. It's a black car underneath. I'm going to keep it yellow after the rally, but for the rally, we themed it around what we're actually doing because we're driving from London, about here in the UK, to Japan via Italy and France. So you can see how this comes together as the country camo, but it's going to go all around the car before the sponsor stick go on top our team number on the doors team 150 then we'll have the main sponsors for gumball all around the car but that exhaust or the rentec downpipe that the car has is nuts so anyway it's time to get an idea where we're going to put some of the stickers see some of the other cars that are in here and crack on with getting this completed as you guys know i'm being joined by benzene ben co-driving in the gtr who mr. is a sticker yeah mr sticker a big fan of his stickers designed our london to tokyo stickers and t-shirts but we're next to mr pog's rs6 support car i think he needs a sticker his are rap we, is actually amazing his rap is like incredible that. all of his raps are He's incredible we'll have a look at his other cars the same around. font as well okay pog is a true kamikaze but i think we just give him a little bit of love there yeah right in the middle yeah boom first gumball sticker there we go done Cheers, right pog. on to the next Let's explore the crazy cars and believe me, the even crazier wraps of the 2018 Gumballers. And there are only a fraction of them here so far. Plenty more to come. I'm going to start us off though, right here with the Lamborghini Urus. I thought there would be loads of them on this year's rally. Obviously, it's just been delivered. They're brand new, the Super Sport SUV. It makes sense as a Gumball car. Yeah. To be honest, we probably could have done with one of those. It's probably, like you say, a very, very good Gumball car, mostly for the same reasons that the GTR is. Comfortable, fast, looks cool, brand new, exciting. Team oh, 18. Space. Anyway, let's keep going because there are loads of wraps to see. Ferrari 458 Italia. Saw that the other day. We did indeed. The AMG GTS in Solar Beam Yellow. The paintwork from AMG that we tried to mimic with the Solar Dub wrap. Pretty much spot on. They look really, really similar close together. A few cars will go all the way up and then come back just to see everything. Like I said, very popular AMG GTR. There is a turbo. Have you spotted what's on the roof? Yes, it's a it's a tire, and I did check it's a real tire. Oh, is it? Okay. Yes. So he's clearly either preparing for the worst or well, intending to do something. Oh, okay. Got a tow thing as well. Okay, so, so prepared. track work is coming. We do stop off at a racetrack on the way. Okay. AMG GTS 911 GT3 Love from Dubai. This really cool design on the side. Oh, I hadn't actually spotted that. Okay, yes, a lot of work went into that. Very much on theme, creating an anime design. There's a lot of that on the rally, which is super, super awesome. So obviously this is a garage full of many other cars, but to continue up, Mr. JWW's 911 GT3 is here, team number 122. Something That's... I know is gonna tickle you is this alternate painted rear wheel. Oh yeah, I don't mind that. The internet might mind that. The, uh, yeah, this I, is... I thought that would, would rub you in the wrong way. But... No, it goes with the wrap. It does. It's Pog 675 LT Spider, which is actually purple underneath. He drove in this car last year and everybody thought it was mine. Now, what is that? Is that Josh Car 2's 812? I think it might be. I like this RS6 in the kind of dirty, rusty police yeah. livery from the Netherlands. That's like a Dutch police car. Then we've got another clever one. There you go. AMG GTR, these guys do the rally just about every year. Uh, Team Scursion Racing, and they've been doing it in 458 Italia the last few years. Always do an awesome uh, wrap right. design. And that is no different. Then we've got GTC4 Lusso, another great car for the rally. Uh -huh. Camo? Yeah, camoed, camoed indeed. Indeed, we've got the ATL Superfast, which, to be honest, Josh has done a pretty nice wrap on this one. It's incredible, isn't it? This is good. Top marks, Josh. Nicely, I I nicely done. On my wall at home, it's a piece of art. It is very, very, very cool. Coming to this line, we've got a pair of very chrome cars, starting with the BMW M4 GTS, silver chrome at the front, and that thing has a pretty crazy design that I can't quite work out. I feel like it needs to be out in the daylight to take it all in. Then we've got the Jeep 
Trackhawk with some crazy amount of power, probably quite an entertaining thing to actually drive. Then we come to the former Nürburgring record holder, the GT2 RS, with a KTM crossbow next to it. But this has recently been unseated by the new Lamborghini Aventador SVJ. So that one's come over from Japan. I always think it's fun to see the sponsors. The white stickers do work very well on the red. Even the red sticker. Hey, yeah, the right. neon. So the theme with the stickers is, of course, white and red. The Japanese flag being white with the red dot in the center. So on this side, we've got a Hurricane with the performance parts that they offer, the carbon body kit parts. Coming back through... Gumball Police car. Gumball Police, NYPD in Europe and Japan. Right, totally, obviously. yeah, obviously, obviously. Meandering back through this way, there's a Gallo Spider over that side. We've got a Panamera. We've got uh, a Hellcat, I think, right there. But let's come back through to this other side, what's tucked behind here, 488 at the back, 488 Spider. 458 Spider. Oh, there's another GT2 RS right here. I think I just walked right past that. And another M4 GTS, given there are only 500 of those in existence, to have a few of them here is quite crazy. Yeah, so silver GT Silver GT2 RS, RS6 being finished up. This M4. Yes, lots and lots of effort goes into the wrap designs this year. It's a bit mental, to be, to be completely honest. So the Mukpog, Wraith. Where else do we continue? So there's a mixture of support cars and other things tucked in down here as well. So learning as we go. Range Rover, Bentley Convertible, another Range Rover, Hurricane. This is Range Rover Corner right here. And then we've got a Dawn from Andorra. Then we have the Pogtador, Pog's famous event door, which he did that computer game video with. Have you seen that? Where he literally hooked this up to a game, drove the car with a projector, like, but controlling it from the steering wheel. Oh, even the Lamborghini logo has changed. Ha! <laughs> Pog to door. <laughs> yep. The Pog has done that. Yeah. Okay. Crazy, crazy. Oh, <laughs> there they are. See you later, guys. 720S. RAV10 Plus. Ah, oh, Pog's new car, the Pogini. He's gone full on this year. Crazy, 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 crazy lineup. And yeah, I think, is that is that what we've got for now? I think so. Not, not exactly bad, hey? Let's head back over to the GTR. This is just, what, we've seen 50-odd cars? Yeah, maybe and there less. are 150 taking part, just to put this into perspective. This is a tiny fraction, and some of the very best ones are not going to get here until official arrivals day, which will follow this. When we register, we get the sign on, yeah. we get to the grid, we see the top 10 cars from the Gumball Foundation grid, where mm -hmm. by sorted by order of donations, most donated means starting towards the front of the pack. We like starting towards the back of the pack slightly inversely yeah. because it means we can film the video for you guys of all the cars getting started and we can see everything that's taking part in this rally. Um, but those are often the guys who go to some real effort to do crazy, crazy, crazy things. And Any early favourites from the wraps? Uh, from the wraps, I'm not sure. I, I know from the cars' point of view there are lots of hypercars to come that aren't here yet. Okay. Lots. I know they said like there's a 918 Chiron, returning. 918, maybe V1, maybe LaFerrari. The grid should be pretty mental this year, but early stages. Yes. This is some impressive progress already. We've barely been here for long at all. You can see the countries going on. So we've got a black Japan down here. Then we've got a gray Italy, black France, the colors and countries mixing in, all kind of laid out here that Dub plotted out earlier on to bring down here to make work in this way. But this is just the start to make it match up like this side. It's looking awesome though, guys. Thank you. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Look at this. Land of the Rising Sun style with the, uh, center here of the sun and the uh, blades going out nice i like that that's very cool nicely done guys what do we have around this side oh, oh cool 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 here we go that's nice that's really 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 cool wicked early stages bit more to go but this is gonna look nuts popped outside and what will you know how you doing and a gumball car arrives ready to rock Need to see that livery as well, that looks a bit crazy. Range Rover rolling by. Joined by another Hurricane Performante Spider, brand new. I think it's gonna get parked up right now, so I should get out of the way. Burbling away with the V10. Lovely, lovely. I just missed a 488, but there goes a 720S and a California T. At the front was a Range Rover. Oh, we can just catch it, just catch it if I run around there. 488 Spider at the front. More cars. And they arrived here in the garage as well. So another 488, another 720S, joining, I think, with the Performante Spider. Supercars everywhere. This is what we like. The G63 we saw the previous night has arrived as well, but basically, it's late in the evening. Things are getting a bit quieter here. 
just all of these things. But I want to come and have a look again at Josh's car, just because the wrap that it actually has is really, really special. It's really like super reflective. So I want to turn the light on it and just have a look at what that actually looks like. Like if you took a photo at night with a camera flash or something, for example. So let's just come up to this and turn on the light. Oh yeah, you can already see it. Have a look at that. It's printed on a reflective wrap. Goodness me. Wow. That's crazy. This thing comes to life. Let's come over and have a look at the other side. I think it's repeated over to this side, but that's crazy. Good effort. Nice, nice work to make that. And benzene was here quite clearly. You know what's happening here though? This is nearly finished. The bonnet now has a complete mix of countries. And what you have to remember is that this is gonna have the sponsors on top, which will connect the dots, so to speak, where you see too much yellow, for example, that will be covered up by the Gumball Roundel. And then the sponsors on the front of those go on tomorrow. And then around the back, it's just one or two last bits to go. I think one more to be placed on in here. And then that's basically it. It's a wrap, or as many of you have pointed out on social media, technically it's actually two wraps, the yellow on top of the black, and then all of the countries on top of the yellow. But this is what we were going for, something unique for the Gumball 3000, as we've seen in this kind of garage preview with all of the different designs people have done, plenty of nice cars about. It's doing something that's unique to each individual car that takes in the theme or atmosphere or style of the rally. And I think we've done it pretty well. So a massive thanks to Dub Customs for staying here to get this finished, to get it ready to now get its sponsor stickers and then to become a proper Gumball 3000 car for this year. The 2018 rally, London to Tokyo, as our wrap shows via France and Italy on the way. This is looking awesome. The countries are evenly balanced around the car. They even did the Land of the Rising Sun style designs for the Schmi logos on the end plates. A very nice small touch. So this is it. This is looking very, very good. I'm not gonna lie though, I am absolutely exhausted and the gumball has not even started. I only slept a handful of hours last night to get some things ready before the filming today. And I think tonight is not gonna be long either before registration and then it's where things really start to get exciting. So thank you very much again to Dub Customs. Thank you to you guys as always for watching. This is still just the start of the adventure. There is an awful lot more to come. So make sure you stay tuned as we make our way down and through the 3000 miles the next week has in store. So thanks again, guys. That's it for now. I will catch up with you guys again very soon. Cheers.